Yep, stone shard. How did I know it? So your hammer, you get rock. Your, your hatchet, you're going to get wood. I bet you get fiber off those giant pot plants. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Man, you legalize weed and look what happens. I'm telling you, for days. <laughs> Even in video games. I love it. What is up everybody? It's your boy Bloodstalker here and I've got something crazy and new. Now, it's not from me. I didn't come up with this. I didn't find it. This was actually brought to me by Anon. Anon sent me a message about it. said, you need to check this out. It is available for download free right now if you want. Or you can donate money to the cause. But it's, it's on itch.io. Now, I played a little bit of the game. I downloaded it for free, but I'm going to go back and donate money to him. I don't know how much I'm going to donate. I'm going to look and see. I might wait till Friday and donate a pretty good amount. The game looks pretty good. It's got a fresh new take on things and kind of different. You're sitting on an alien planet. You're an alien. And you're supposed to have a pet dragon. I haven't found my pet dragon yet. And I might be doing something wrong. But I figured I'd start, go ahead and start the game. Now, it is built on Unreal. It's not Unity. Oh, thank God, a survival game not on Unity for once. No offense to Unity, because I do like Unity. But I just needed something different. I like Unreal for survival. It just gives you that feel. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, let's jump into this and I'll tell you more. It does have an actual storyline to what's going on. It's pretty cool. Many years ago, the Forsians invaded Windstone, the land of dragons and homes to Mkara. As seasons passed, Windstone fell into ruin. Many perished and only a few dragon eggs survived. The Windwalkers, those who the dragons allowed to ride them, are Windstone's only hope. You are one of the last Windwalkers. What is up, everybody? That's right, it's your boy Bloodstalker. And that's right, it's a whole new game. Oh, yes. You can't blame me for this. This is a non-user's fault. I'm just strictly going to tell you right now. I'm going to call him out for it, for what it is. It is what it is. This is called Windstone. It's a beautiful little game. i probably done an introduction of it. Well, that's something new. I haven't seen that. Jesus Christ. Just every time I play I've played this a couple times so far. Um, I was recording a video and I decided to start over because I was like, just we haven't really done a good job explaining this and I felt like I wasn't doing a good job. Plus, I was still kind of learning things, figuring out. I still have yet to find, I haven't found freaking hemp plants. If you look up there in the top right, you've got UE navigation, press M for world map. So here's your world map. Now let's talk about a little bit about this. You might have, I, I don't know what I said in the beginning of the video or not, but we're going to start doing this. So this is a single, single player survival game. It's open world sandbox crafting. It's built on the Unreal Engine. The light areas on the map right there are what's developed. Like it says, mostly developed, mostly undeveloped is the dark shaded areas. Um, right now, the game is, is it's pretty fun. It does. I haven't ran anything bugginess. Other than the fact I cannot tell you um, for the life of me where I need to find freaking... Oh, here, get these done with. Where I need to find hemp plants from. I, I, don't, I see these giant hemp plants. What was that? Glowflower. Light, cla light casting plant. Oh. I can't equip it? Oh, here. There we go. I got a light now when it gets dark. So you do have some you have some creatures in the game. You got those things which look like giant aphids to me. Just brown aphids. Have you ever seen a, a little bitty aphid? Like grass aphid? That's what they look like to me, I'm telling you. I may be wrong. maybe call calling something else, but it looks like a giant one. That looks like a giant roly-poly. Does it not? I'm just lumbering around. Well, it's got so these peacock looking things. It's got so much stuff to it. It's pretty cool. It has a storyline as you've already seen. Oh my god, there's hemp. Are you kidding me? Am I being troll here? What the hell? I've been. I, where the hell did you come from? Oh, that's that Unreal Engine spawning mechanic. You gotta love that. Oh wow. I can't believe it. We finally found it. Now I just need to find a branch. Now, if I can't find branches, I'm gonna cuss. <laughs> yes, I will. I walked all. I tried to go up to the top up there, and that's where I. That's why we're doing this now again because I fell all the way down and died almost. I survived it. How I don't know, but I survived it once. Oh, good. So this is hemp. I knew it would be. See, I was looking at these big hemp trees. You can't pick the big ones. Maybe when you. Oh, I bet you when you get a tool. All right, can we craft? 
Okay, double click on the hemp in your inventory to make a cordage. Oh, you just double click on it. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. Gives you three per. I'm impressed. A game that gets it. It better not take three planks to build something, though. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Anyway, so let's see. What can we craft here? So craft a stone hammer. So you go to your bush craft. Now, there's a whole stuff. We got to go through a lot of this stuff. This game is on itch.io. If I've already said that, I'm sorry. I'm rehashing it, so I know I said it. This is on itch.io. It's for free. You can donate money to them. I encourage you guys to donate if you ever do get into a game that you play. You try it out. If it's something you like, by all means, do it. So we need a hammer. I'm going to go back and donate to these guys. I've been playing this long enough that, I, you know what, this is a legit fun game. Now, you do have health, hunger, thirst, stamina, and body temperature. You got your XP bar down here. I don't know what the leveling does. I don't know how that works for, like, blueprints or anything. I don't know what you get out of levels. It's kind of interesting. Let's equip our hammer. Hammer! I'm so excited. Oh, there we go. I need a hatchet, don't I? I'm making a hatchet. Make a stone shard. Okay, bushcraft. Oh, I'm getting this now. So you have to craft pieces to get to the thing. I wish you had a search, though. Where do you... Is that a stone knife? No. Where's a stone shard? Obsidian knife. That's nice. This is all the craftables you got. I'm looking for a stone shard here. Oh, I know how to do that. I bet you I do. That dude's getting awful close. Those guys will chase the living crap out of you. You don't believe me? Go just watch, yeah. I'm guessing the, st the hammer's on the rocks. Well, we'll go up here and see if this dude got any beef with us. Maybe he ain't got beef. I don't know. Now, they're also like... Here, look. We can pick up a gourd. Oh, I love it. Gourds. We got... We got... What do we get? Oh, you can eat these? Hardy vine fruit. Uh, gourds in real life, I don't think you'd want to eat. Yep, stone shard. How did I know it? So your hammer, you get rock. Your, your hatchet, you're going to get wood. I bet you get fiber off those giant pot plants. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Man, you legalize weed and look what happens. I'm telling you, for days. <laughs> Even in video games. I love it. Sorry. I am stupid. What can I say? So anyway, the game has a lot to offer already. Even though it's on itch.io. I'm really impressed with it. I mean, this is a legit fun game. Craft a stone hatchet. Now we can craft us a hatchet. Oh, look at that. We need more branches, but I have a funny feeling. It's not going to be hard to get. Let's see if there's any more gourds over here. Oh, we want gourds. Now, you do have a little inventory system. This game has a whole lot of aspects to it. If you notice, food items, like these blue caps, you can eat the mushrooms, but they, only, they don't stack. So it becomes an inventory management thing. Now every time you eat a mushroom, of course, your thirst goes down. So they do have adjustments for that sort of stuff too. Which to me is pretty cool. I like that. What do we get off of that? Well, that gives us water. Oh, gourds are good to eat. What is this? Empty water. Oh, now we got an empty gourd. Oh, and they stack. I'm not hungry. Well, what if I want to eat it? Damn it. Alright. Where's our hammer? We've got to equip that. Or, excuse me, not our hammer, but our hatchet wood make a staff from a branch so you get branches from hitting trees basic you can pick them up off the ground too dude i'm loving this game oh my god yes i'm i'm stupid with this i love games like this they always get me and it's really i mean it looks pretty good it reminds me of a cross between wildlands and like um in arc and conan's things like that really not so much conan yet it just, it has that Wildlands kind of graphics and animation. Now, here's your character, by the way. You are an alien. Three toes, three fingers. Uh, you have no junk, apparently, so... <laughs> yeah. He looks like he's stoned on acid, does he not? He just looks fried out. It's like, yeah, I drank the wrong punch, and I'm just kind of not feeling it today, guys. Gonna have to go on without me. <laughs> you know that shit's funny. Don't lie. Anyway, I don't know if those dudes are bad, too. Let's see, we need to bushcraft this up a thing. They look like giant roly polies, though, for real. I, I'm going to keep saying that because that they do. Oh, do I just... See, I like how you can... Yeah, you just right-click on it. That is so freaking cool. I love that concept. You don't have to... Okay, now we made a branch. Now craft a stone knife. Okay, I'm kind of watching by the corner of my eyes. Weapons? Uh, tools, I bet. Yeah, stone knife. Craft. That was weird. Did I level? I leveled. That's cool. It's even got an effect for when you level. Badass. Alright, now we need to craft 
Oh my god, find bamboo if you have none crap if you have none. Craft a stone spear. Oh my god, man. I love it. They got it's got a whole thing. Now you also have a journal. You got current task, completed task. So here's our current task. Okay, current task. You navigate. Oh, I never did hit P for a pause. Alright, hold on, let's do that. Close the journal up. There we go, we paused the game. Yay! Oh, I paused the game. I love they do that, though. I mean, it, that's the one thing about a lot of games that come out in early access now. There's not any really help. You are freaking weird looking, dude. You look like a... Whoa. Yeah, what's up? Okay, yeah, we're gonna go this way. <laughs> My bad. Okay, good. They just give you a warning. So far, him and the peacock looking thing, which we haven't seen yet, but... Oh, here. Maybe I'll show you. I knew it was getting him. This is a okay. I told you it was a giant pot plant. <laughs> Call make fun of me for that. I want all the comments either edited or deleted. Come on, go back and do it. Okay, what do we get off? This is just like regular wood. No branches. So you get a bunch of stuff now. Like you said, stackables are that. Eat. I love you can just right click to do it. So you know. You gotta keep doing it though. I wish you could set like a limit. That's all right though. I'm not gonna complain. Okay, dude, I'm over here first. Why are you coming at me? Jesus, everything. All right, so now we gotta some find some bamboo. Oh, you look like bamboo. <laughs> it's like I'm just walking into it. I walked around this place for ever trying to figure out what to find freaking hemp, what to do this. It's right in front of me the whole time. I would just stayed over here. I ran past the outer part of this area. I did not come through here. I didn't notice. I feel bad, man. I had a bad spawn. We'll blame it on the spawn. How about that? You probably all spawn at the same spot. All right, so we got some bamboo. So craft a stone spear. Um, weapons. I guess that will be under weapons. All right. Let's equip that. Oop, we're lethal now. Kya! Stone spear, baby. Now we need to craft a bone drill. Oh, excuse me, a bow drill. <laughs> a bone drill. Don't ask. Don't ask. Oh, there we go. Bow drill. So we need a staff. So we need to make one more staff. Dude, I love the crafting system in this. This is pretty damn cool, actually. This is this is unique for what we're used to. I know I can pick this stuff up. This is like, yeah, arrow, a bow sapling. Then they have arrow lilies or something like that. It's pretty, I mean, it's neat. It's a whole different concept. Not a lot has been done to the game, as you can tell. But the fact that they've got all this stuff now... So you got your like task uh, task objectives are stored and shown here. Check for journal. It just gives you gameplay tips. N for to mute music. B to uh, do your hot or HUD. H to toggle equipment on hotbar. K to screenshot mode. Oh, that's cool. They even got a screenshot mode. It tells you all your basic stuff, and then it tells you what you've completed, so you know, and then what you got to do. Dude, I'm loving this. For an early game like this, they've got a great start. He's got a great starter. She, I don't know. It's probably it could be either or. I'm not gonna not gonna act like I know. It's, no, it just says one developer. Once it had, once I saw one developer, I mean, shit, you had me at that. I mean, seriously, these are funky looking trees. I don't want to go near that thing. All right, make a tender bundle out of cordage. We gotta stick with the paths here, man. You can save the game. Finally, an early access game we play on the channel. Oh, pause. There we go. Save. We're going to go ahead and save slot one. There we go. So beautiful. Game saved. We can come back and play again. <sighs> We're going to do... I'm going to play some more. I'm going to keep an eye on it. This game is fun so far, dude. Let's see here. What was I... Oh, I got to make a fire. I got distracted. So, bushcraft. Or here. I click on cordage, I bet. Yeah, make tender. See, I love that. I love how you have your basic, like, crafting menu, and then you have your, like, sub-craft. You have two crafting menus, basically. That's pretty damn cool, in my opinion. You hear, him, you hear him clicking at me? Click away, son. Click away. Now, back there seemed to be the only place to pick up hemp, but we can hit the hemp trees, the giant hemp trees now. Okay, good. He's not following me. We can hit the giant. We can hit them. We got hemp. We got hemp. It just cracks me up. All right. Now, I wonder if more animals will start spawning in as I keep restarting the game. It seems like that kind of has happened. I don't know why it just does. All right. Oh, we need water. Shit. I don't know if we can drink the ocean water. Let's go run down here and just check. There is like a, a landlocked little area there. Don't wander off the beach right now. I would, I would wait. I would just wait until you get comfortable 
and you got it because you, you got to have water in it. You, you, you can't make it. That is a complex series of what WT, just what the, you know what I'm saying? It is the most, it's, it's like a maze trying to get up there. And you can't climb up the walls. You can, but you can't. Oh, you got to hold the button down too, by the way. Feels good. Dude, this game's so freaking fun. All right. So we can drink the ocean water. Did I tell you about the two moons? Yeah, or two suns? That one's already set. That one sets first, apparently. God, this game. It's so freaking just badass. All right. I just, we need to make a torch now. So, is it like a thing here? There we go. Torch. Craft. Nice. So we're out of staves, which is all right. Let's equip that. Um, build a campfire. Let's see. Weapons, tools. Campfire in there? No, it's probably going to be a building. Survival? I would think survival would be what we need to do. Roasted venison. Nice. Oh, there's a seat. We can make an empty gourd. Oh, nice. Now we got a water container, so we need to go fill that up. So there's a fire. We need more stone. All right, since we're down here by the water, let's equip our wonderful new gourd. Look at this. We're making progress. Where's it at? There it is. Oh, oh, we don't have to carry it in our inventory. Sweet. Just right-click on it and fill. <laughs> we got water, baby. Dude, that thing, see, it sets pretty quick. All right. I'm all over the place, man. This game is fun. I, it's been a long time since I've had this much fun playing a game. Can I eat another gourd? Alright, let's make a... I want to make another one of these. I want to make sure we got plenty of water here, dude. Water is serious shit. Agave. Oh, you can put agave in there? See, there's so much crazy stuff in this, man. I'm loving this. Look at that. Didn't even have to get out of my inventory to do all that. Did it all in one spot. Didn't have to quit. What the... Yeah, there's some glitches. Now, this, like I said, this is Unreal, and Unreal is kind of like that sometimes. We're going to go this way. Not a big fan of that, dude. We're going to kind of build where they're not going to wander. So build a campfire. Let's get some stone. There's a rock right there. We'll go... Hmm. Big rock? Small rock? Big rock? We'll go for the small rock. I bet you can't hit that one. I just had that feeling about me. Don't know why. I wonder when I get my dragon, man. There's supposed to be a dragon. The pictures, the artwork, it had a dragon. I want to know where my dragon's at. Hopefully, I, maybe when we get a one level. There's one of those peacock things. We'll have to check that out, too. Did I see like a st yeah stone? So we are getting regular stone off of this too. So this is like getting you like flint and stone. Did we just level again, dude? We're level four, dude. We're a super dude. It's freaking awesome. You have to hit the button to harvest every time too. Oh, I'm out of stamina, is why. Here, let's craft our fire campfire here. Dude, really, we got so I cannot believe how far we're making it. We're just we're doing so good. All right, now watch this. Check him out. I wonder if I can take him. Yeah, come on. Oh, 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 shit. No, I can't. He's hurting me. Oh, run. Oh, he's pissy. He's got claws. I don't like this dude. Oh, we're going to die. See, I had to go and mess with the dude. Bad decisions were made. I'm going to have to test that one. Now we're bleeding to death, and I don't know how to make a bandage. I did save the game at least. At least that's smart enough for that. Hope it didn't autosave. Oh, he finally stopped chasing me. How do I quit bleeding? I'm not hungry. I'm about to die. Look. How do you quit bleeding? Oh, it's been nice knowing you guys. This is what it looks like when you die. Back off. Back off. Maybe the gods will have mercy on me. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to be doing more content on this. Am I still alive? How am I still alive? There we go. <laughs> I'm going to be playing more of this on the channel. Um, this is a fun game. Like I said, I'm going to donate, I don't know, probably like 10 bucks to this dude because this is amazing. The game in itself is fun. There are some weird little buggy things with it, but not nothing bad. You've got stuff you can do in the game. It's probably got enough content. It's probably got enough in it right now just to wet your beat, just to give you an idea what to expect. But I will say this much. Keep an eye on it. If not, for the fact that this will be on Steam soon one day, and this is, a, this is going to be a pretty big game. It's going to be pretty fun, I think. I think this game has potential to be good. That's all I can say. As long as the guy keeps working on it, or the person continues to work on it and develop the game, I think we're going to see a lot of good progress out of it. It's all going to be in a matter of how much response it gets on the beginning, I bet. If everybody gets on there and supports them up front, I think, the, I think that they'll, they'll be downright nailing it on it. So, anyway, 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, go check it out. I'll leave a I'll leave a link down to the uh, link to the game in the description as always. Um, also, I'm gonna post it on um, the Discord. Don't forget, if you're not part of the Discord, go out there, click the link at the main part of the YouTube channel. Join the Discord. It's free to join. You're more than welcome to come on there. We've got rooms set up for gaming on there, fun things like that. Come hang out with us. You know you want to. I already knew it was going to stop. Anyway, I've been your lovely host, Bloodstalker. This has been Winstone. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that thumbs up button for me. Just destroy it. Show the developer behind this game that, that you like it and you want to see something like this happen because it looks looks amazing. Anyway, till next time, you know the drill. I can't do it in the game, but hey, peace out. Uh. Yes. Now this is not, are you coming at me, bro? I really can't do nothing to stop you from it, so you look kind of creepy. Okay, yeah, you're not good. We're gonna run at this point. Oh my god, he's on me.